Well, I'm Stephen Buckridge, I'm a painter. It's very hard not to tighten up, but it's very hard not to, uh, you know, to on sense. A lot of my, my work is kind of takes quite a long time because I'm con constantly kind of uh, re-evaluating it. Sometimes wrongly, sometimes right, but it's kind of difficult to not to let things go, but to sort of to find that point where something is kind of right. So always right, kind of right, rightish is the word that says. <laughs> and yet you have to be very disciplined, which is important. Um, I did an MA what, five, six years ago at Middlesex, which was great because that part time, I'm still be teaching, and it's you know, it made a big difference to work. And that kind of dialogue, you kind of miss that dialogue. Yeah. It's hard. You, know, you need that kind of critical reflection, which is um, you know, the way the work kind of sometimes goes forward, sometimes goes back. Yeah. Very just the way materials re respond in a kind of a chemical kind of way or a kind of physical kind of way. My work is about space. Um, I like the idea of something about, about being between states, neither one thing or another. So it's, they are abstract, but they have elements that might be sort of representational that could suggest a surface or an aerial view, or could be sometimes architectural, but they're not. They are about materiality, um, how um, spaces kind of work together or jar against each other. They're quite subtle. Um, I think in many ways the paintings you almost have to look at them to kind of get something out of them. They're not going to be uh, kind of instant gratification. I like the idea of looking into a painting and you kind of understand the process of how it's been made. So you see clues of the beginning of something or the birth of something. But the drawings are much easier because the drawings are kind of spontaneous and instantaneous. So now, in a sense, they are about kind of just a layer. So there's lots of the stuff that goes on here, it goes on in here, but it becomes cancelled out. Maybe because you can't make a, a mark that has that same kind of tension, like with the drawings that a pencil line has a kind of a tension to it. And the erasing that goes on within them is the same as the erasing, go, erasing goes on in here, but obviously in here it's about the layering as a process of erasing. Whereas in the drawings it's about the physical removal or the sort of uh, playfulness and the way the surface can suggest something or retain its kind of character or destroy it perhaps.